My name is Ariel Henley. I live in the San Francisco Bay Area. I grew up with Cruzon syndrome and a uh, facial difference or disfigurement. Uh, as a result of that, I am a writer and activist and work in disability support services at University of the Pacific. I mean, I've seen a lot that concerns me, both the message that we should just, you know, take one for the team, basically, um, which that's kind of horrifying and just sort of, um, I mean, uh, from a personal standpoint, just kind of knowing that if I were to catch this virus and have to go to the hospital, I'm pretty much going to be out of luck um, and on my own. That's really terrifying. And knowing that it expands to a whole lot of people um, and it's just sort of accepted by a lot of people is very upsetting to me. It's just, well, we have to do what we have to do. And it's just the policies of the hospital. We just have to ration things certain ways. Disabled, non-disabled, we are all people. We're all people with lives and loved ones. We all, our lives have inherent value. I mean, as somebody who grew up looking different, I can tell you my worth and my, everything about the person I am is tied to my appearance. And um, every single time I go to the hospital, I feel like I have to justify my humanity and prove that I am a valuable member of not just our like local, area but like hey please treat me please treat me with respect help me because i i i want to stay alive even and that's really what it comes down to is can you please just respect my personhood produced by rooted in rights